Hey everybody, it's me Sissy and I'm back today with a uh, DIY Goodwill Christmas flip. We're going to take these sad little treasures from uh, Goodwill and we're going to flip them and make them just a little bit better. So I have three little projects today and then I have one that we're just going to clean up. It doesn't really need anything done to it. So always check Goodwill first when you're looking for something. But um, anyway, stay tuned and see what we do. Okay, the first thing we need to do is we need to remove all this stuff from the um, snowman and all of this stuff needs a really good cleaning. Okay, so we've got our snowman all painted nice and white and looking good. So we'll, let's get him fixed up. Get all his parts put back on. Now we have our snowman with no face though, so we got to work on his face. First thing we're going to do is we're going to work on his hat, because we don't want to put this brown hat back on, but I am going to use this little batten on the inside. And we're going to make him a cool new hat from these Santa socks. So, I'm going to turn him around to face me so I can see how to do his hat. So, I'm going to just cut the sock off. Get a string. I'm going to use a piece of white string. And we're just going to tie the end up. Now, so we won't have this um, outside showing when we make a cuff on our hat. We're just going to fold it up and then fold it back down and tuck it in. So then we have a nice printed edge for his hat. And we're going to put his cotton in. And then we're going to stretch it on his head. And then he has a cute little oops, can you see little Santa hat on. So we're going to just glue that down.
Okay, now for his scarf, we're going to take his other sock here. We're going to clip it off. Then we're going to measure around our snowman and see how long we need our scarf to be. That'll be just about right. So now we want to glue these two pieces together. Put them right sides together. Press it down. Then we're just going to take it and roll it. Roll it. Then we're going to put a little dot of glue there. Have our little snowman's scarf. We're gonna put it on him. Let's see what side we want to do it on this side over here. So our little snowman's ready for the snow. So all we gotta do is take care of his eyes and his little mouth and his carrot nose and we'll be done. Okay, now we have to decide do we want googly eyes on the snowman or painted on eyes. I like googly eyes. So we're gonna think about it. But for the nose, we're just gonna take a piece of felt. I'm going to make it into a triangle and we're going to roll it We're going to roll it into a carrot shape. There we have our carrot shape. And now we just need to get it fit in the hole. So we'll trim off the end.
Okay, so now our snowman is getting a little personality. He's got his nose on. Now we're going to give him some eyes. And I'm going to go with the Google eyes. I like Google eyes, so. And y'all not here to tell me what to do. So, we're just going to put a drop of hot glue. And if I don't like them, if they're too creepy, then I can take them back off. That's probably my sister texting me and telling me not to put Google eyes on her snowman. Is she okay, Papa? What's the matter? Is my Papa crying? Come here, Dot Dot. Come, what's your mama doing? Yeah. Mama's not playing with the dot dot. Come here. Say hey to everybody. Say hey, see, I'm the dot dot. He's my girl, yeah. Mama, come play with you in a minute. Go on now. Okay, so now we need to do his mouth. And we're going to do that with lumps of coal. Or black paint. I'm going to practice this first. Okay, I think that'll work. So, do one in the center first. Well, he's not perfect, but he's got character. So that's what we're going for, character. And then we just need a little bit of blush on his cheeks. And I have some pink paint for that. I'm just get a little tiny dab. I'm going to wipe that off, y'all, so don't freak out. Okay, so there's our redone snowman. I think he's cute. I'm sure my sister will love it. We've him. got our pa um, pot painted, and now I'm going to take these markers I got at Dollar Tree. They're actually glass paint brush markers but anyway we're going to highlight the um, snowflakes on here so we're just going to take it and just it doesn't have to be perfect we're just going to
Okay, so there's our little embossed pot, and I'm going to go give it a spray with um, a so clear So I've got my stars all painted white, and now um, my table, well, in my kitchen, I've got kind of like a galvanized metal-looking ornaments on my Christmas tree, so I kind of want to make this look like galvanized. So, spread these out a little bit. Oh, I got too much on that one. So I just mixed several different color, um, gray and black and silver and my paint and I've just got just a little bit on my brush but I got too much black, some of this black off. Okay y'all, that's it. My three flips were four. I actually had the little container, all I did was clean up. I've already got it on my bar so I'll show you when I show my Christmas I'll show it to you when I show you my Christmas tree, but we've got our snowman, the container for my Christmas tree, and then the napkin rings, but um, they're still drying, but I can get one of them up. So I think that's going to go good on my table. But anyway, y'all, I've got my list and I'm crossing them off. I'm like Santa, but I don't have a naughty and a nice list. I just have the to-do list. <laughs> But anyway, y'all, get out there. Um, Christmas is coming. It's still got plenty of time to decorate, make crafts, and um, get together with friends in limited amounts. So y'all be safe. Have a Merry Christmas, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.